Hey, I'm Ron Daler from Mastodon. You're watching Rock and Metal News. Hey guys, this is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News with a Rock and Metal News update. Soulfly were joined on stage by Morbid Angel frontman David Vincent on May 4th in St. Petersburg, Florida. Vincent contributed on the Soulfly track Blood, Fire, War, Hate with footage available in the link in the description of this video. Axe Wound, which is, uh, comprises of members of Bullet for My Valentine, Cancer, Bats, X Rise to Remain, released a new track titled Vultures on May 5th. The song features a guest appearance from Avenged Sevenfold guitarist Sinister Gates. In related news, the group has booked the following European and UK shows. The dates are in the description of this video. And As I Lay Dying have began tracking their new album at the Blasting Room in Fort Collins, Colorado. Bill Stevenson is producing the new CD. Chrome Division have issued the following lineup changes and that they are working on their new album. Mr. Bern Luna, our longtime bass player, increased members of his family some time ago and wanted to shift focus in his life. All respect to our musical brother ever since the inception back in 2004. We wish him all the best. Luna will work with us from behind the curtains of doom and contribute on the lyrical side of things in the future. Ricky Black left us a while ago due to personal issues. Thanks for all the good times and keep those licks going. For a while, while we have been working heavily on the new album with our new permanent members, our new bass player, Ogie, has been filling in on the sessions live guitarist and bass for a long time and he is now aboard for the ride. The perfect successor and natural choice to welcome into the ranks. On lead guitar we present to you the extremely talented Damage Carlson of former Breed fame. Shoes hard to fill but he damn near broke the mold. Both guys are an inspiring addition to the songwriting process and the new material smells like burnt rubber. And Evocation has announced the departure of based bassist Martin Torre Torreson. The band issued the following statement. It's with great sadness we have to announce the departure of bass player Martin Torre Torreson from Evocation. Torre has been a part of the band ever since the reunion in 2005 and has grown into becoming a brother with us. As we are announcing the departure of Torre, we wish all, also like to announce that we are now starting the search for a new bass player for Evocation. We're looking for an experienced bass player with live experience and that has a state presence. If you think you can fit the future bass player for Evocation, then please send your application together with some lines about who you are, video clips and a YouTube clip, photos, etc. to marco at evocation.se. This is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News, and that's a Rock and Metal News update. Thanks for tuning in.